voucher, a very important document in bookkeeping. In fact, this is the document from where accounting cycle starts. Voucher is in fact a document which is prepared by bookkeeper at which two accounting heads are identified, which are debit and the second one is credit. When we recognize these two accounting heads as debit and credit, we also give value to each accounting head in the voucher, which is known as measurement. So voucher is a document which is used for recognizing each accounting head along with measurement of each accounting head in terms of reporting currency. So voucher is in fact evidencing that the transaction is complete. It shows us a verification. The transaction is complete as to its documentation, as to its calculation, as to its approvals. The voucher is in fact a piece of document which is written by the bookkeeper. But remember that with each voucher, the bookkeeper is obliged to attach source documents. You see, bookkeeper is not the expert to give value to an accounting head. Obviously, that value is coming from some expert or based on some document. So while putting information on the voucher, the bookkeeper is obliged to complete that voucher with the support as an evidence that whatsoever is written on the voucher is supported by certain documents, which is also known as source documents. So there are different types of vouchers. Journal voucher. Journal voucher is used to record two accounting heads before putting that information into a journal or recording that information into a journal. So journal voucher is normally used for credit transactions. Then petty cash voucher. It is a voucher which is used to record petty expenses. Cash receipt and cash payment voucher. This is the voucher which is used to write cash payments and cash collections on the voucher. Remember, all these vouchers are prepared by a bookkeeper and then are approved by a signatory, a person who is responsible to approve these vouchers. Different people could be held responsible to approve different vouchers. So cash receipt and cash payment voucher is a voucher on which we put cash transactions. Bank receipt or payment voucher. We are also entering into transactions with bank. Payment through bank. Collections in the bank. So all those transactions before recording into the books of accounts are written on a voucher for approval. Gift voucher, interesting one, okay? 
गिफ्ट वाउचर इज अ वाउचर विच अ बिजनेस एंटिटी गिव्स टू इट्स कस्टमर्स फॉर बाइंग सम गुड्स फॉर फ्री बेस्ड ऑन दैट वाउचर सो दैट गिफ्ट वाउचर बिकम्स अ सपोर्टिंग एविडेंस फॉर दैट ट्रांजेक्शन अगेंस्ट विच अ बिजनेस एंटिटी did not receive any cash or will not receive any cash because the goods were sold based on a gift voucher so let's do a practice in which we'll see that who is responsible to prepare journal voucher supplier manager bookkeeper or accountant so the bookkeeper is responsible to prepare journal voucher journal voucher is used to record transaction in well in general journal in general ledger trial balance or balance sheet journal voucher is used to record transaction in general journal then comes which voucher is used as a proof that significant cash transaction has occurred between two persons remember one thing that it is about significant cash transaction so petty cash voucher cannot be a correct option cash payment voucher is correct answer to this question that which voucher is providing us a proof that significant cash transaction has occurred then comes which voucher is given by seller to customer that gives right of free shopping or discount very easy gift voucher okay and interesting as well which voucher is prepared in support to transaction of collecting money in bank from customer yes it's a bank receipt voucher okay so important tips to remember in this module ittr okay number 1 voucher is the first document which is prepared by the accounts department of an entity to start accounting process and then voucher is a documentary evidence that transaction is complete and verified got it thank you